As Hamden Academy gears up for the completion of a new campus, they are also getting ready to welcome a new mascot. And it's the students who are joining together to help build it. Our Lindsay Mills shows us how. With a new campus on the way, so is a new Bronco. Forrest Hart, a sculptor and Hamden Academy alumnus, is lending his time and talent to top the original bronze Bronco he donated exactly 20 years ago. But this time around, he's got some help. I think I've already promised my family I'm gonna I gotta get a picture of me uh, in my graduation clothes riding the Bronco. I think that'll be pretty interesting. On most Saturdays since last fall, students travel to Hart's Monroe studio, lending extra hands in the molding process. And recently, their younger siblings, who've tagged along, are showing some interest too. We would put these slabs of clay on, and then we would... They call them pancakes. I wasn't a particularly good student in high school, and I had my own interests, and my interests were not what they taught in schools. I was interested in animals and, and uh, painting and drawing. Uh, if I was in high school and had a chance to do this, it would have... Uh, I, I would have just been in heaven. With the ever amplifying cost of bronze, the value of this stallion is estimated to be between $125,000 and $150,000. Keeping taxpayers in mind, Hart is raising the funds to absorb the cost. Because we have done a tabletop bronze of this and we're selling those. For those who can afford the $2,600 donation. They get the name on a bronze plaque that says they helped donate it for for it and they'll get a book. And that book is one Hart is currently working on, documenting how the bronze bronco was made. Both versions, big and small, were modeled after a wild stallion in Wyoming. This monument is 30 percent larger than life size. Upon the anticipated August completion, it will weigh nearly 2,000 pounds and will gallop rather than rear like the old one. Those whose tiny fingerprints are impressed in the clay say they can't wait to look out at the statue they helped to make someday. I hope this comes together well and I want to see it in ha um, at a Hamden Academy when I get there. In Monroe, I'm Lindsay Mills.